Hello guys, I am Prithamshu and you are watching Prithamshu Dev. In today's episode, I am going to show you how you can make unlimited entities in Lucina and Dev. How you can start it, make a train equal to entity and then model equals to none and collider also equals to none and then from polynoise sorry, import polynoise and the noise equal to well, noise brackets octaves equal to 2 and c equal to now I can put any cd1 for example I am going to give a set of 100 then train underscore width equal to 20 you can give as much as you want and I can change train dot train underscore width multiplied by train underscore width and then block equal to entity with the model equals to cube and color and if you want you can give a color color equals to color dot green and then block dot x equal to i by train width and block dot z equal to i by train width and then block dot y equal to noise bracket double bracket block dot x by next two variables frequency equal to 24 amplification equal to 5 give the frequency comma plot dot z by frequency and then multiply them with amplification and then float out of the values And then we need to add block dot parent equal to train and then come out train dot combine then train dot collider equal to mesh collider and then train dot texture equal to white cube you can give any other texture you want and then for testing we need to input from Osina the prefabs at first person controller and for first person controller then call the first person controller and then run it so here you can see that it shall be fine without any lag at all normally with this much entity it lags a lot and then that if you want you can input the numbing from numbing you put the floors the the result should be a bit better and then you can simply change it as much as you want the more values you give in there the more time it will take to run the code but it won't still lag you can see it's not lagging so that's it for this video i'll meet you later and i'm pretty close to 100 subscribers to make sure to subscribe Thank you.